All right, it is 98.5 KISS FM, Carpool Karaoke, right here with our friends at Cumberland Kia. And look who decided to jump in the passenger side seat. All right, Lee Ray. Hey, guys. I'm happy to be with Freaky Dave this morning. It's been a long it's time. Been a, it's been uh, too a long. Almost like a year and a half since we were together. The thing is, we spent years together. Years, literally, sitting across from one another. Wow. Me, it, irritating you to the point of... of insanity i know but today you said you'd be nice i uh, today i i said I, I would be nice and that's why we invited lee ray we have the kia hamster back here woo -woo -woo. there he is whoa watch out listen there's not many times in this world where you can drive around town with a, a life-size hamster in your back seat it's a little it's a little scary it's happening today with carpool karaoke with our friends at Cumberland Kia. Lee, we're in a brand new 2016 Kia Sorento. This thing is nice. It is very nice, I'm loving it. We got the sunroof open, beautiful weather. We're cranking a little 98.5 KISS FM right now and you're gonna sing with us a little bit. Yes, I am. Carpool karaoke now, I gotta tell you, one thing that drove me nuts about doing the morning show, the freak show in the mornings with Lee all those years, was Lee loves to sing. Well, I thought that was fun. You like that. And it, and it actually was fun. And, and one thing about sitting across somebody for, what, five, six years? Six something years. Like six six years. years, yeah. yeah. I, I learned every musical every taste morning. that Lee Ray ever has. Um, sometimes it led to possible almost altercations with celebrities. We'll talk about that. One of our favorite songs, one of Lee's favorite songs that he would go in and try to sing each and every day was... Um, this one right here that we're going to start off with, with Carpool Karaoke. Lee, it's your favorite. Oh, the Carpenters. It's the Carpenters. Well, I have a lot of favorites, but I, I, I like this one. Do birds suddenly appear every time Lee is near? <laughs> Just like me. They long to be. Get away. Let's get a hold hand. Oh my gosh, this song. no. We're just Stop singing. distracting the driver. You walk by the Just like me. They long to be close to you. On the day that you were born, we got together and decided. How many times did I have to hear you sing that song during the freak show in the morning? Oh, I love it. More times than I can count. Lee is quite possibly the biggest Carpenters fan I've ever met in my life. Oh, I don't know about that, but uh, I do love me some Carpenters. Now, I'll tell you one thing, Lee, I, I, and, and I really mean this. I've said this to you privately, you know, in some events we've, we've ran across each other at. I really do miss you being on the show every morning. I mean, I, you know, I, I knew I'd miss you, but I didn't know I'd miss you this much. It's just... You haven't replaced me. It, it's like it's like going home every night and your <laughs> wife's not there. Oh, please don't say something like that. Well, I had to get away from you, to be honest oh, with I you. I know you did. You were getting a little possessive. Uh, I know, it I know. It scared I did. me often. Well, you know, we had some great memories on the Freak Show in the mornings. And, of course, one one morning, and this was... Uh, no, don't tell this story. Years and years ago. No, no, no I, have, I have lots of stories. Oh. I'll, say, I'll save that, you know, during your funeral. Um... Anyway, you're um, not invited to speak. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna crash your funeral, let me tell you. Anyway, uh, so Billy Ray Cyrus shows up at, oh, uh, at the radio station. Not the one Billy morning. Ray story. Yeah, the Billy Ray story. Oh my gosh. He showed up to uh, talk to uh, some of the folks on the station next to us, of course, talking about his new country album. And at the time, Miley Cyrus um, hadn't become the Miley Cyrus that we now know and hate. Uh, it was the Miley Cyrus that we know and love post Hannah Montana when she was going out on her own just as Miley and um, her songs were still wholesome. Well, and if you'll recall, she just finished shooting the movie in Columbia, Tennessee. Yes. Uh, uh, that uh, the was Nicholas on. Sparks and, adaptation, yeah. And Billy Ray. The was, hamster knows it. Evidently, he's a big Nicholas Sparks movie oh, fan. Oh, Hammy. How yeah. about that? <laughs> um, does he have a name or is he just the hamster? Are you the Hammy? You the hammy. He, he's the ham. Oh my gosh! Put that on. Don't yes. go. Don't yes. drive. Uh, I'm not going anywhere else. No. He has no his. Hammy? He has his bling on. So that, I'm glad about that. I feel. Mr. T. Hammy. Exactly. 
Um, yes, and so Billy Ray was, I mean, I hate to criticize him, but he was trying to jump on Miley's popularity and get his song out there. Exactly. Or his new, he had a single coming out, and of course the album. So he thought while Molly was doing good, he would try to ride that popularity. Solo album. And I got the bright idea. Lee and I were in the studios, and I thought, you know, Lee, we need to get Billy Ray Cyrus in here on the Freak Show in the mornings because, I mean, hello, his daughter is like one of the biggest... She was one of the biggest names in music right music now. She had one time. of the, the number one songs right now at that time. So we asked Billy Ray to come in and we had a, a great conversation with him until um, Lee Ray decided to sing Billy Ray Cyrus this song. It's the cloud. At this point, after Lee Ray sang that part, I literally thought, and I and I will still swear this on a Bible to this day, I thought Lee Ray was getting ready to get hit by Billy Ray Cyrus. Well, that man turned the brightest shade of red I've ever seen in my life. I I, I have to say I was a little worried. I, mean, <laughs> I was too, because I'm on like this side of the console, and Lee and Billy Ray on the other side. And man, Billy Ray looked at Lee Ray, and I have it on video, it's something I'll treasure forever, looks at Lee Ray like, what in the heck are you doing? But, What's but, wrong but, with you? But the whole thing was a positive point because, I mean, everybody knows I like to use music to, to make people feel good, or sometimes you do need to make people feel sad, but this story, that song is a song that makes people feel good and feels like they can achieve their dreams, and that's what I've been telling him, how cool that was, that that's what Molly was singing about, so I just wanted to Here you go, Lee. share Here you the go, moment. Lee. the climb. Goodness gracious, man. Memories are coming back to me. I feel like I'm in some like sort of motion picture or something. I feel like we're cruising Cookville in the summer, you know, <laughs> like singing to the, to, the, to the songs. Oh, should we park somewhere on the side no. and pop the back and, and really get crazy? All right, well, of course, Lee Ray joining us for Carpool Karaoke right here with our friends at Cumberland Kia on Interstate Drive in Cookville. We're in a brand new 2016 Kia Sorento, and man, we're having a good time. We're not worried about getting a little warm, man. We have the, the sunroof and open. That is cool. I'm loving this car. I am too, man, and it drives really nice, let me tell you. Now, uh, one other song before we close out Carpool Karaoke, and then I go to church immediately and pray for both of us. <laughs> um, one other song that one of your favorite artists is Elton John. Yes. Um, and one thing you'll learn about Lee if you've ever got to spend some time with him, Lee is quite possibly one of the most positive people. I, I felt like I had a life coach with me every every day. Um, and now my life is going horribly wrong because Lee Ray's not in there with me anymore. Don't blame me. You're a big Elton John fan. And don't think a couple weeks ago when he was in Chattanooga, I didn't think about calling you and saying, dude, let's take a road trip to the Nuga and see some Elton John. That would have been cool. As you can tell, I don't listen to a lot of Elton John. You marry a music man. And his little accents in there. Yeah. Ballerina. Well, I don't feel normal without the glasses on either. <laughs> Everybody's looking at us, Lee. Oh, that's a tall Everybody is sitting here looking at us going, why are you guys singing like Mad Men and a hamster in the back? we're having fun. Yes, we are having fun. Oh, I forgot about, I forgot about the hamster. And the hamster's in the back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, was, I was getting weird tags. Oh, I guess that's what it's yeah. about. Hold me closer, time to dance, love. Count the headlights on the highway. Lee, I've absolutely loved this time I've gotten to spend with you today. It's been oh, too thank long. You. Of course, uh, nothing, nothing like jamming out to some Carpenters and some Elton John with Lee Ray. Let me tell you. Yeah, I'm sure everybody in town's ready to do that. Yeah. It's not going to surprise me if you, if there's a website that pops up where Lee Ray will drive you around and sing with you. But listen, man, you've been a good friend for a long time. I love you to death. I hope you know that. I think you know that. Oh, of course, Dave. We had some great times. I mean, six years on the air, but we worked together five years before that. Exactly. So, so and you know, I thought. You're doing this out of the kindness of your heart. I thought, what better way to kick You're off not paying me. carpool care? No, we're not paying you. I'm sorry. Do I get lunch? <laughs> you don't get lunch either, but no. you get something even better. Okay. Have you. Oh, I have something. Right it's not the hamster. You is get it? something even better. <laughs> I decided. Oh. 
If you know anything about Lee Ray, Lee Ray is a pickle connoisseur. Oh my gosh. He I love loves pickles. pickles, okay? So I figured that <laughs> I would get you some hamburger dill chip pickles. I love it. And, and then Mount I, Olive. And then when I was sitting there getting those at the grocery store, I'm thinking, you know what? That might not be enough to get you through the weekend. So oh no. I got you two of them. Oh my gosh. Wait, so, I have two two jars of two pickles. jars of pickles, and then I thought for a second, wait, you know, I've known you too long, Lee. <laughs> what else is coming? What happens if you go back to WCTE to go and do your regular job? Yes. Well, is something I else thought maybe you way. needed a snack, so I got you some dill pickle chips. Some dill pickle chips. Oh my yes. gosh! I have to tell you, today was my niece Molly's birthday, oh. and I texted. This morning, and what do you think she said? Thank you, Uncle Pickle. Oh, uh, see, Uncle Pickle, right here next so, to me. I love right. some pickles. Dave and I made pickles at the home yes, show one year. Yes, and then I thought for a second, okay, you have your dill pickles, which will last maybe yes. through tonight and part of tomorrow. You now have your dill, dill pickle potato chips, but what if you get thirsty? Oh, you're, no. So I thought, you know what? You could just pop the top on this, <laughs> some dill relish, and just squeeze it out and drink it right there, Lee. <laughs> <laughs> it takes a lot to get this man speechless, okay? And I've done it. I've won Dill today. relish. Yes. Well, it's one of those things where you can pop the top and just squeeze it and you can pour it in your mouth. That way it doesn't distract you when you're driving. You can drink pickle juice, too. Well, you that, too, which I'm sure you probably do. Well, I'm not saying I have, but... Mm -hmm. Lee's, so, Lee's thank favorite. you for all the pickles. Well, I, well, I like some pickles. Lee's yes. favorite thing to do during March Madness <laughs> and uh, any time um, during the, the Titans NFL football season is he likes to do uh, pickle shots. Uh, <laughs> That's good. <laughs> That's going to be a whole other topic for a whole other time. Oh, my gosh. This has been a blast. But thank goodness. you. Thank you, Hammy and, and our friend Brandon back there. Goodness gracious. Thanks too much fun. Carpool karaoke coming to a brand new Kia vehicle near you very soon with the free show in the mornings online at kissfm985.com.